Hello everyone, welcome to the automotives. In this animated video, we will take a quick look on working of electric car horn. Nowadays, horn is essential feature in modern cars and you can find them in almost every single vehicle. In addition, driver also uses it very often while driving. So today, we we'll discuss about electric car horn in this video. This video will include the types of vehicle horn, the general wiring circuit of electric car horn, internal construction of electric car horn, and at last working of electric car horn there are many types of horn are available in the market but we can divide them into three main categories according to their construction the first one is bulb horn second is electric horn and last one is air horn bulb horn is used in auto rickshaw as well as in classic cars Electric horn is popular along modern automobiles while air horn is provided in heavy vehicles such as trucks and trailers. If we talk about general car horn circuit here, connection from battery is directly connected with ignition switch. It advances to the solenoid coil of horn relay and finally reaches to the horn switch. To close the entire circuit, negative end of battery and other end of the horn switch will be grounded. One more connection from battery's positive terminal is connected to the contact breaker of the horn relay, while the other end of contact breaker is connected with the positive terminal of horn. To complete this entire high current circuit, negative end of horn is grounded. Specifically, inside the horn, there is main horn body which consists of solenoid made of a plunger and coil. The plunger is directly connected to the diaphragm where the diaphragm is hinged to the body in such a way that it acts as a return agent or return spring for the plunger. One internal contact breaker is also provided with plunger and mounted on the horn body which connected with the positive line of the horn relay and another side of solenoid coil. When you turn the ignition switch on, the horn circuit complete and thus you can operate the horn. When you press the horn button, current from battery passes through ignition switch to the relay coil and advances to the horn switch due to completion of primary horn circuit. This causes the relay coil to get excited and close the contact breaker which closes the high current circuit of the horn. High current from the battery directly travels to the horn contact breaker via relay contact breakers which causes the excitation of solenoid inside the horn and it attracts the plunger inside. Thus, diaphragm got deflected with opening of circuit via contact breaker, which removes the excitation of coil and plunger returns to its original position, which causes the completion of high current circuit again. This cycle repeats very fast and vibrates the diaphragm at specific frequency, which produces the horn sound. So whenever you press the horn button, it activates the relay and relay vibrates the metal diaphragm at specific frequency and instantly you hear that beeping horn sound. That's all for today. If you have learned something from this video and you want to watch more videos like this, please like this video, make sure to press the subscribe button below and hit that bell icon so you get notification on every new upload from the automotives.